uh, uh, before we even start, Christine, I just wanted to say thank you uh, to you um, for being so incredibly generous. And thank you to Wilson and Rachel for agreeing to, to spend some time with us tonight. Uh, we made- yeah, No problem, my pleasure. Um, up over 240,000 this year going virtual with, you know, a whole change of scenery for us. And in the, the three years that I have been involved, this event has raised up over $800,000 um, to help those who are battling Huntington's. There are a lot of organizations that help try and find a cure, but we have to remember that there's a ton of people living with this thing day mm -hmm. in and day out and battling it. Um, it's in my family. My mother-in-law has it, but uh, you know, her husband is retired and is able to be with her and help take care of her. But a lot of families don't have a caretaker like that. They don't have a place to go. They don't have therapy units to go and talk to. And they don't have a center of excellence where they can go and speak to a doctor who is fully versed in Huntington's. And that's what a lot of this money goes to. Yeah, um, you know, uh, and speaking with Natalie years ago, um, you know, somebody in Chicago four years ago, the closest center of excellence they had was Houston, which wow. is crazy because that Huntington's is, really is a long way. Yeah. And that's not the case anymore. Now we have, we have uh, centers of excellence all over this country, you know, within hours of anybody who, who might be dealing with it. They have a, a safe place to go, to learn, to be told the proper information, to help uh, find the proper therapy for all of this. And, and then uh, also to get them into the loop of, of that there's a whole community out here and, and, uh, and we're here to support them. So, you know, what you gave uh, is going to, to a very, very worthy cause. And I, I can't thank you enough.